What's up guys? Welcome back. Transformers Reviews. Transformers Generations. Titans Return Blitzwing. Headmaster. He shouldn't have been a headmaster. So. Anyway, but uh, this figure is 10 times better than the first generation figure we got. I mean, we got better articulation, better knee articulation in particular. Uh, better head sculpt. I didn't like that last head sculpt. It looked bad. And uh, tank mode better, plane mode better. It's like they weren't even trying with the first one. <laughs> At least tank mode looked like a miniature. It looked like one of those little tanks you get in. Like in Akari Warriors, that's what it looked like. But uh, there he is. Nice, you know, light gray, purple, and tan, and dark gray. A little bit of white in there. I think they kept it from, from the Megatron pieces. But other than that, it doesn't hurt it. You got some nice, let me get close to that. Nice stickers on there. Already on there, which is good, which I like. Lots of detail on the figure, you know. They did, see, this is it. They do a good job on this guy. They do a good job. They did a good job. But then you, some figures, just like Astro Train, was probably like the, the cheapest one they made. It was just like, the Astro Train they made was just like, ha they half-assed it. So they still, I still think Hasbro needs to do a better Astro Train. Because the one we got wasn't that great. It's better than the first version, but not better than these these, these two guys blowing away. So, and uh, I can't come in on Broadside because I don't have them yet. But Broadside looks all right. They gave him the worst jet mode, but I think you could Make the fan mode, which is better. But anyway, let's get a close up of this guy real quick. You know, there you go. Smile for the camera. Stay still. Okay, so here's a close up of Blitzwing. And uh, Blitzwing, they got spot on. That cream color, the purple, and the yellow. Turn it around real quick. And yeah, some translucent plastic there. Really good details. And, uh,. Did a great job on him. Again, I still don't understand, just like I said with Octane, why we got Megatron first. Megatron, make, make those guys extra guys. Everyone wants Blitzwing and uh, Octane and Astro Chain to a fault. And that, even Astro Chain came out in the second wave. He didn't come out in the first wave. It was that Sentinel Prime orange guy that burns your retinas. But uh, some good detail, lots of detail on him. Uh, got that sword. Uh, swords not better than the uh, first generation swords we got. The gun, of course, you can hold regularly, but I like it on the side better. I wish they would have given the original gun. Hopefully, Shapeways will do that. But uh, let's see. Do you want to pop his head off? You know, I'll pop his head off real quick and show you guys. And oh, oh, there it is. Yeah, there it is floating. Cream and gray, no details. They could have at least put some purple on there since the face is yellow and purple. But they said, screw it, we don't care. We're Hasbro, We're not Takara. Put it back on there. And get on there. There you go. All right, he's got two molds, guys, you know, jet and tank. Let's start off with a uh, tank mode. Okay, here we go. There's a uh, Blitzwing in this tank mode. And uh, great, better, way better tank mode than before, I'll tell you that. It's got the nice turret there. What bugs me though is like these feet here, they don't come down and they stick out. So if you see from a side view, it's like, uh, I mean, it doesn't get in the way of the turret, but it just, it, it doesn't look good. They could have had them like fold away somehow. But, uh, of course, obviously the wings fold down. There's the, there we go, the scimitar or whatever they call it. Nah, the, uh, sword and, um, the extra gun, you can put it on here. I don't think it looks that great. It looks kind of like goofy. I think that's like too much, so you don't really need that. It's better like that. It does move around. It does do? I think it does do a 360, right? Oh yeah, it does. There you go. Oh, there's his face. He's looking at you. And uh, yeah, nice mode. I mean, kind of a uh, not complicated transformation, uh, but a little challenging. But once you do it a few times, it's no problem. But they did do a good job. You know, nice paint. You can tell it's a blitzwing from the just looking at him, so that's good. Uh, wings folding out is okay; it doesn't bother me too much. But uh, speaking of wings, and now uh, you got little little octane there driving. No, little little wing, little blitz. Uh, let's get him in the plane boat and do that. All right, guys, there's blitzwing in his jet mode, and a uh, huge improvement over the last version. And uh, looks more like a jet. You know, undercarriage a little bit, <clears throat> some stuff going on. But other than that, though, great. Of course, you can see the driver in there. 
you know. Definitely, these guys are definitely worth it. Octane and Blitzwing, they <clears throat> hit the ball out of the park. Home run. Uh, can't say that for Astro Train because Astro Train was just kind of, to me, Astro Train was a lazy design. But these guys, they really went to town on, and I'm glad because it really shows here. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, I mean, guys, if you don't have these guys, definitely pick them up or try to get them or get the Megatron to prime and recolor them. But these guys are definitely worth it. I mean, home run. Good sh good, good deal on these guys. Uh, transformations are intricate, so it's not like you get your money's worth, definitely. So uh, there you go. Titans Return Blitzwing. Three modes. Uh, triple power. Guys, I'm Mike Ruthless, and I'm out. I'll see you guys next time.